Hello people today we will look about how to fix the process system isn't responding issue on android so hello guys my name is pooja and you are watching gossip funda solution 1 updating your device software for this go to your phone menu and then select the settings when all the option on settings appear scroll down and then choose software update option after that you will be able to see an option called check for updates choose it if you have an updated available then you have to download it immediately so choose download now after your device is all done downloading the install file it will likely ask for permission to begin the installation solution 2 updating individual applications for this go to phone menu and then look around for google play store open it once you see it after this tap on the profile menu and then click on manage apps and device in this you will find an option of updates available click on it and after this you can find all the unupdated apps click on update to easily update them solution 3 deleting catch get to the menu and then go to the settings app after this you will find the option of application and permission click on it after this tap on app manager you will see list of all the apps click on the messages sometimes you have to choose from the system app or all apps then click on internal storage after this tap on clear data or clear catch solution 4 do factory reset of your mobile for this press the power button for a while then you will see two options power off and reset click on the reset option solution 5 solve process system isn't responding error by unrooting for this head over to settings and then tap on additional settings there you will find an option of backup and reset click on it here factory data reset or erase all data option is there tap on it on the next screen confirm your action by selecting the reset phone button after selecting the option your phone will begin the process during which it will reboot a couple of times once your device reboots you can set it up and the root access along with super user apps will be detected by the device and for this process make sure you have all your important data backed up and secure
Solution 6. Move your SD card apps to internal storage. Move your apps to your phone's internal memory by either uninstalling and reinstalling them or using apps to SD Pro. If you don't have enough space in your internal storage, consider upgrading your SD card. You might want to use an SD card that's lesser than 32 GB if you are using an older Android device. That's it guys. There's a link of our website in the description box. Do check this out. And I hope you like this video. Don't forget to share this with your loved ones. And subscribe Gossip Funda.